Two of Warner Brothers' major upcoming animated titles will head to streaming as part of an unprecedented shift for the studio's release strategy during the continually changing cinema-going landscape. And I've got all the news right here. Before we get into this, don't forget to hit that like button down below. It does wonders in getting my content out there. And if you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button and the bell icon to keep up to date with all my content. Tom and Jerry and Space Jam 2 have been caught up in what has been called Warner Brothers' swift response to the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic in America and will head directly to the HBO Max streaming service in 2021 for a one-month window along with the entirety of the studio. 2021 release schedule, a total of 17 major tentpole films. Good news is the films will still open in cinemas day and date on their intended release dates in states and counties that are deemed safe enough to have open cinemas. We have of course seen many major movies this last year delegated exclusively to streaming services and others such as Wonder Woman 1984 be given this exact split model with a simultaneous streaming and theatrical theatrical release. However, effectively moving every single one of their tentpole movies to a streamer is an absolutely unprecedented move from a major studio. While Warners is adamant that this is a pandemic only measure and a creative solution to the situation, it's almost certain that if the model is successful, it will become the new norm for major film release strategies, particularly with every major studio now the proud owner of their own streaming platforms. And this is actually something that Hollywood has been pushing for the last decade. It also shouldn't come as a surprise if other major studios such as Disney adopt this exact model for their entire 2021 blockbuster release slate in due course. Tom and Jerry is still set to land on its March 5, 2021 release date, while Space Jam A New Legacy is still set for July 16, 2021. Other major films set to be affected by this model include The Suicide Squad, The Matrix 4, Godzilla vs Kong, Mortal Kombat, Dune and The Conjuring 3. For now, it's likely that all of these movies will head to a theatrical only model in international territories such as the plan with Wonder Woman 1984. However, that could change once more when HBO Max starts to roll out overseas. If you'd like to keep up to date with all the biggest cartoon news, don't forget to like and subscribe to see more regular installments like this. And if you're keen on diving deep into the history of all your favourite animated characters, don't forget to check out my continuing cartoon evolution series linked at the end of the video. And at that, it's over to you. I want to know, what are your thoughts on all of this? Are you looking forward to seeing Tom and Jerry and Space Jam 2 on HBO Max? Or are you a bit annoyed that you don't get to see it in a cinema if you're not somewhere where a cinema will be open? Fire away down in the comments below and let me know your thoughts. Hey everyone, if you haven't yet, smash that big old subscribe button up on your screen to keep up to date with all my content and hit that like button down below. Also don't forget to check me out on social media and please consider supporting me over on Patreon for as little as a dollar a month for exclusive videos, early access content and to get your name up on the screen. Thanks again for watching.